right, Sash, sum up your feelings. How are you feeling through that last <laughs> night? Um, mixed emotions. Obviously, really happy that we managed to walk away with the win. Um, but yeah, uh, oh, we probably all made it a little bit harder than what we wanted it to be. Um, but particularly at the end with that, uh, yeah, that over had it all. <laughs> Who are the, the conversations that you have out there? You're one of the senior players in the team. Who do you chat to just to, to calm things down? Yeah, well, at the end there, obviously, um, Nico's a great resource, the captain, so um, she's nice and calm uh, for most of the part. So just to, for her to come up and take a second out of the game, um, yeah, that was really helpful for me. Is that something that the group you felt this year has, has developed over the, the 13 games so far? Yeah, definitely. Um, I think we know that the game's going to change a lot, the momentum's going to change. Um, but, and when it does go against you, you do need to take it, you know, that extra moment just at the top of your mark or in the field just to get yourself settled, um, get back on track. So I think we've definitely got better at, as the games have gone on with that. How impressive was it today from a team point of view? You know, you can't make finals, but the energy seemed to be up, the enthusiasm seemed to still be there. How, how impressed were you by the, the young group? Yeah, well, um, throughout the season, we obviously haven't had every result go our way, but I feel like our group has done really well in keeping um, keeping the energy up, making sure that we're still being competitive, which we have been throughout the tournament. Um, and today was no different. We wanted to make sure that we finished the season on a high. So one more game tomorrow and hopefully we can get another win, but it's really pleasing to, to come, across, come away with a win against a quality side like the Scorchers. Where do you think it leads the squad for the next couple of years as well? Obviously, we don't look too far ahead, but um, it's a young squad, it's a developing squad, but goodness me, they can play some serious cricket when they get going, like we saw with the, the batting, with no one really standing out. Yeah, that's it. Um, it. It's a really exciting group. Um, yes, young in age, but um, we still have some really experienced players. Um, some of them, the, even the young girls, have played a lot of cricket. So it's really been um, really enjoyable to see them step up in different moments um, throughout this tournament. And I'm really excited to, to see where they can go over the next few years.